what is going on everybody and welcome back today i got a short one for you guys regarding call of duty black ops cold war specifically i want to discuss the state of the game versus the community as a whole but before we get into any of that do me that favor hit the like button subscribe if you haven't already and definitely ring the bell for notifications in the background you already know i got some call of duty black ops cold war alpha gameplay so do enjoy that as we get through it that all being said let's go ahead and jump into the topic of discussion so at this point everyone has laid the alpha build of the game and the honeymoon phase has faded leaving behind true opinions of the game i personally recognize that the beta build was good overall but not perfect the game is still on the fence meaning that it can go either way when it comes to being good versus being bad it all depends honestly on what the devs decide to do moving forward okay let's be real the sniping was out of control quick scopers were everywhere and clearly had an advantage the devs stated that that was done on purpose but i call bullshit i don't think it was done on purpose and i believe they actually got caught with their pants down on this one but otherwise i'd say that the gunplay was good it was a mixed bag of guns and i hope that there's more guns and more tweaking and more balancing when it comes to the guns overall but we're obviously gonna have to wait until the beta to find out whether that's going to be the case or not there is a lot of good here but i do think that they have a lot more work to do and i am looking forward to the beta to see if they actually implement some of that work into the next version of the game when it comes to the maps that they actually put out satellite was a good starter map moscow was also solid i didn't have a problem with moscow it actually flowed pretty well it actually kind of reminded me of arsenal to be completely honest but it, it was solid now when it comes to to that Miami map that was total trash it was too much going on where was the map flow there wasn't any but it's okay though because I have the solution go ahead and fire the person who designed that foolery map and then bring in somebody who actually knows what they're doing furthermore the big ass elephant in the room became apparent very quickly the skill based matchmaking it was definitely present you could definitely feel its presence and as a result you already know the G fuelers out there were all over it they immediately hit the socials and began going to war basically over this reigniting skill based matchmaking versus the actual fun of the game the sweats or the pros as they claim to be immediately started to reverse boosting yep it's going to be one of those type of years unfortunately there was also a poll that went out over twitter basically concerning the topic of skill based matchmaking and its involvement um i believe like 80 90 000 people actually did respond to that and obviously everyone said to create a rank playlist but you already know the devs don't care let me tell you what they're gonna do they're not gonna include a skill based matchmaking only rank system and they're gonna leave it just the way it is suck it up buttercup because that's exactly what's going to happen the days where the community actually have a say are gone if they did implement a ranking system or a skill based matchmaking playlist no one would play it why because everyone wants to feel powerful everyone wants to have fun when they're playing the game thus if you had an option to go to the rank playlist where skill based matchmaking is enabled or to go into some pub and stomp the hell out of noobs all day you're definitely going to pick stomp the hell out of noobs all day activision treyarch etc whoever's developing the game they don't want that they don't want you to have fun they want your money and they want to appeal to a younger generation who also need those protections in place those training wheels huggies in a digital form basically they don't care about the true fans they don't care about the old school guys like myself the call of duty veterans they just want the money and to appeal to the masses so they can make said money that is about it for me when it comes to this one i don't really have much more to say concerning it i would like to know what do you think about it let me know down in the comment section below appreciate you all taking the time to watch my video don't forget to hit the like button subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and definitely hit the bell for notifications of new uploads i appreciate it all and i'll definitely definitely see you guys on the next one.